anabolic steroids for beginners. What steroids should a beginner take if they're going to go down that route? In this video, I'm going to let you guys know what's the best steroids compound to use if you never used it before. And just to let YouTube know and you guys know that this is not um, about promoting the use of anabolic steroids. This is just for educational purposes only. So um, please don't take this video down. Like I've said, I'm not promoting the use of anabolic steroids. I'm just, um, it's just for educational purposes only for people that don't understand. Right, so if you're a beginner, and you're thinking of using anabolics, heads, performance enhancing drugs, whatever you want to call it, steroids, then um, I'm assuming that you've already been lifting for a couple of years at least, um, and, you're over, and you're over the age of 21, because if you're under 21, I don't recommend it. Um, um, number one, need to get some blood work done. Go and see a doctor or go private. Get some blood work done privately if you don't want to go to the doctors. If you live in the UK and by the NHS, they don't always uh, do it for the sake of it. But yeah, get some blood work done. Make sure all your levels are good, that you're okay, that you're healthy. And now let's just assume you are healthy or you're not even going to bother getting any blood work done because most people don't. And you're thinking, oh, what should I take? Um, I wouldn't take anything else for your first time. I um, wouldn't take nothing else apart from testosterone as an injection based. So that could be testosterone, Elethe, Sipine, Nekine, um, or the Snow Esther testosterone. Which is, uh, Uh, that 
will boost your natural testosterone function production back to normal because obviously when you're taking injectable, injectable testosterone you're shutting your natural production down why does it shut down is because your body is having this all this artificial and more of artificial testosterone your body's like oh hang on we've got no testosterone we don't need any more so your body stops producing it that's why you need to take your pct not everybody takes a pcc pct some people get on well without taking a pct but if it's your first steroid cycle i recommend taking a pct and then to do that do that for 12 weeks so you get on if you don't know where to get stuff from i'm not telling you where to get it from but what you want to do is, is google search and places you can get it but if you've already been training like I said if you've already been training for a couple of years which I recommend you at least you need to be training for a couple of years before you even touch or think about anabolics then you would know someone in the gym by now that um, who's on it or can get it or whatever but don't be fucking stupid and go on shit load of gear it's not going to do anything in the long run you'll end up taking more and more and more and your body will will need it to, to see any growth so you're going to start small very small amounts and then you come off at the same time you've been on three months on three months off and then next time you go back on you, you'll still need only a little bit of amounts because you've only been taking a little bit of amounts before so um, yeah, that's my advice to beginners. There's nothing else you need other than testosterone for our beginners. Steroid cycle, if it's your first steroid cycle, you need nothing else other than testosterone and maybe some d -ball. Don't take oxy because they're very toxic for the liver. And uh, maybe on your next cycle you could try oxy but they're a lot more, there's a lot more side effects with um, oxy -ball. oxy -ball, which is um, oxymethylone, anadrol, um, d ball Dianabol. So, um, yeah, just testosterone. If you want to take a tablet as well, maybe some d ball as well. No more than 30 mg of d ball a day for four weeks. No more than 300 mgs of test per week for 12 weeks. So, yeah. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the thumbs like. Hit the thumbs up. And I'll keep this uh, content coming. Cheers for watching.